This is problem number 9 from the August 2014 Algebra Regents exam. Sam and Jeremy have ages that are consecutive odd integers. Now consecutive, in case you're not sure, means that they're one after the other. For example, if one of the odd integers was 5, the next odd in integer after that would be 7. We also know that the product of their ages is 783. So if we multiply their ages together, we get 783. Which equation could be used to find Jeremy's age, j, if he is the younger man? So we're going to use the variable j to represent Jeremy's age. And if we multiply that with Sam's age, which we know is two years older, right, because it's the next consecutive odd integer, um, since Sam is going to be two years older, we could represent Sam, Sam's age as j plus 2. Just erase that there. Okay. Um, so if we multiply these together, we get a product of 783. And we can see from these list of options that what they've done is they've expanded this here and multiplied this together. So you'd get j squared plus 2j equals 783. And that looks like that's option number three. All right. That's, uh, that's all for this video. Thanks for visiting JD's Regents Preparation.